Hi, this is Jeremy Kellett, Director of Recruiting here at Oakley Trucking, and I'm your host for this podcast. This is the Oakley Podcast, and this is episode 93. So on today's episode, I'm going to talk numbers. Uh, I'm going to specifically talk year-end numbers and uh, some of our owner-operators and explain a uh, settlement summaries to you. So we're going to dive a little bit deeper. It it shows uh, all revenue earned, expenses paid out, uh, net money, and number of miles driven. And I want to go over that. So if you just always listen to this podcast, I encourage you to YouTube this one and see for yourself these numbers. It'll make it a whole lot easier to listen to uh, if you YouTube it and actually watch because I'm going to go line by line on the settlement summary and show you what it is and how it works. So but before we do that, let's do the Oakley update sponsored by Arrow Truck Sales. Keith Wilson at Arrow Truck Sales in Springfield, Missouri is currently offering $1,000 off your first month's payment when you finance with transport funding or $1,000 off the truck price if you bring your own financing. They're also discounting the cost of an extended warranty by $500. Aero Truck Sales has been a long-time partner with Oakley Trucking, and that's because they specialize in first-time truck buyers. They don't do any leases. They have the best used trucks money can buy because used trucks is all they do. They don't sell any new trucks. And the biggest reason that Aero and Oakley are partners is service after the sale. It is very important to us at Oakley that when we refer you to a company, that they are a good company with good people. They do what they say, and they understand our requirements. So give Keith a call at 573-216-6047 for a good used truck and tell him you heard about it on the Oakley podcast. Okay, Oakley update today. Got some good stuff for you. Number one is fuel discounts. I know we talk about these fuel discounts quite a bit, but I I still don't know if all our owner operators understand that we're getting some great fuel discounts from all the big name stops, Pilot, Loves, um, TA, Petro. Uh, but you've got to take advantage of these discounts. And the way you do that is on your Transflow app. And if that's if it's not coming up on your Transflow app, then you can go to the website. And it's through the driver portal. You can do that. But take advantage. You need to pay attention to these because just because you always fuel up at Love's doesn't mean you're always getting that best discount. Typically it is with Love's, but you got to pay attention. And I encourage all y'all, it's a lot of money right there that, uh, that you can be taking advantage of. So fuel discounts is really good. I appreciate also appreciate all the, uh, the stops that give us these discounts. Man, you just don't know how – how good we have, how much we do appreciate them and our owner operators appreciate them too so also the other thing i was talking to dispatch basically they said freight has uh, just picked up right where it left off it's rocking they're hollering at me all the time going hey we need trucks we need trucks we need trucks so that's a good sign it's always a good sign makes it a little tough on the recruiting department but that's all right uh, and then, as always on the Oakley update, I like to recognize one of our owner-operators. And this guy here uh, has been with us 24 years. He's a great owner-operator. His name's Hilbert Heinsch, and he lives in Floresville, Texas. He's been with us 24 years, like I said. He's got a 2016 Peterbilt, and he uh, he pulls for Russell in the hopper division. I asked Russell a little bit about him, and he said <laughs> – I knew the first thing he was going to say. He said, well, his wife, Pat, brings us peanut brittle every Christmas, so – we love Miss Pat for the peanut brittle. And uh, his handle's Red Wing, if you didn't know that. And he said he's just a fun, uh, easygoing guy, easy to work with, and, and he's proud to be able to dispatch him. And I tell you, Hilbert, we appreciate you too, man. You're an asset to Oakley Trucking, and we appreciate you being here 24 years. Okay, let's talk settlement summaries. You know, the first thing you might think is, what is a settlement summary? Well, that's why I'm going to show you. We're going to go line by line. But basically what a settlement summary is, Summary of all of your settlements all year long that you were paid by Oakley Trucking. It breaks down all the revenue that we've paid you. Then it breaks down all the expenses that was held out of your settlement. And it gives you the uh, net money. And then it breaks down your loaded miles and empty miles. Great, uh, great tool we have here at Oakley Trucking. I want to also give a big thanks to the accounting department because they already got all these done, you know, almost 800 owner operators and they got them done quick, uh, right out of the gate. And it's just, uh, they do a fantastic job to be able to get these numbers and make it super simple for a man like me to understand. It's gotta be simple. So let's look at a team first in the pneumatic division. So these numbers are going to be big because we don't have but a handful of teams, but, uh, these people, 
they are workers. And, and on these settlement summaries, I'm not going to show any names or anything because, uh, you know, that's it's private information. But I am going to show you these numbers, and we're going to go down line by line, and I'll try to explain the best I can on all this stuff. So let's start uh, with a team in the pneumatic division. And the first line is percent of revenue. Well, some loads, there are occasionally some loads that you might get paid a percentage on during the year, whether it's short loads. Typically, it's just shorter loads. So that's what that is. The next line is anniversary bonus. So we pay an anniversary bonus to all our owner-operators. And basically, it starts with your, when you start working at Oakley, you build up, you get paid $0.10 cents a loaded mile that you do that whole year. And on your anniversary date, rolls back around that first year, we cut you a check just for being here. There's no catch to it. I mean, well, I guess the catch is you got to be here. If you don't, if you're not here, you're not getting it. If you work 10 months and you got a bunch of money built up in there, you get zero if you quit So, or get terminated. So keep that in mind. But this is just a, a something that – we offered a, started a long time ago, and we just upped it from five cents to ten cents on your first year, and then you get your second year you get eleven, third year you get twelve, fourth year you get thirteen, and it just keeps going up, and there's no cap to it. Anniversary bonus is fantastic uh, uh, deal we come up with to to be able to help an owner operator to look forward to something every year. So, all right, that's the second line. Third line CSA mileage pay. If you don't know it, here at Oakley, we pay you based on your CSA score. Now, if you lease on to us, you automatically have a zero score, which means you get top pay, which is $0.25 cents a mile. If you have violations while you're at, it, at Oakley, then that can go down if you get written up. So their CSA mileage pay here is 53227 Next is demerge pay and demerge pay by day. Those two lines, they basically go together. I, I think one of them is, you know, if we paid a, a hourly demerge or we paid by day, they just separated it by the line. Escrow interest, you do get a little bit of interest on your escrow that you get. We have a $5,000 escrow that you have to build up with Oakley. Flat pay rate, uh, you know, occasionally there'll be a, a, where we pay them a flat pay, you know, I don't even know what an example would be like for that. Uh, sometimes it's a load, but uh, I think you don't see that very often. Fuel surcharge pay, you know about the fuel surcharge. Um, it fluctuates as fuel goes up. Your fuel surcharge pay goes up. Fuel goes down, it goes down. And we paid them 61000 in fuel surcharge pay. Layover pay, you do get some layover pay. That's a little different than demerge. Uh, the demerge, we are able to bill the customer. The layover pay is pretty much we just pay it out of Oakley's pocket for layover. So you get some of that, $6,500 worth. Mileage pay, $310,623 in mileage pay. Bam. Then the mileage surcharge. So in November, we did a... Um, I call it freight surcharge because freight's rocking it so good. It, we, we did an extra $0.10 cents on all the loaded and empty miles starting in November. We're doing it on 90-day increments and reevaluating it to see if we want to keep doing it. That's what that is, $2,900 because it started in November. Recruiting bonus, hey, we, uh, we pay $5,000 for uh, – them to recruit somebody and then a hundred dollars for the actual lead actually that lead now is 150 bucks we pay but so they they got somebody leased on then the uh, vacuum pay the flat rate and the vacuum charge pay basically the same same money uh, because they're pulling a vacuum pneumatic so they actually load themselves and we pay for that pay them to do that then you get your total, 1099 total is $470,406 for these owner-operators. Wow. That's what I'm talking about. $470,000 they grossed here at Oakley Trucking. Now, we're, going, we're getting to it. We're going to see how many miles they had to do to gross $470,000. But first, before we do that, I want to go down this expense line. So that's the revenue earned. Now let's go down these expenses on this settlement summary. The first one is base plate fee. Pretty simple. 
if you don't have your own base plate, you can get our base plate. We charge you 30 bucks a week. That's what that 1590 is. Escrow payment. If anything was taken out of your escrow, if you had a full escrow, $5,000, and like right here, this is $351, something, you know, something was taken out of there. You know, I, I don't know. It could have been something in the shop to fix or who knows, 351 bucks, but typically nothing. Fuel tax, pretty simple, $53. Uh, miscellaneous shop charges, $919. That is probably like servicing their blower, maybe changing the oil in their blower, that kind of stuff, be in the shop. Getting signs, could be anything. Um, miscellaneous expenses to the owner-operator, same thing. Oakley Yard Fuel, so we, you can get fuel here at Oakley's Yard and just come out of your settlement. Occupational accidental insurance, I believe that's $43.90 per person per week so that should be what that totals up for 52 weeks pre-pass they have a pre-pass that's the total for the year qualcomm rental scale tickets reimbursed pretty simple tch miscellaneous purchase i'm gonna say i do need to double check on that i'm gonna say that's the death fluid because we have fuel broken out and then i think they break out the the death fluid too Tractor fuel purchase. Oh, yeah, tolls. And much tolls we reimbursed because the prepass covers the tolls now. But the um, tractor fuel purchase. So they bought fuel $106,875 worth of fuel. And then, of course, you'd have to add in the, uh, the Oakley Yard fuel, too. So that'd be their total fuel expense. Trip pack transflow charges, 207 bucks, And you can see, I mean, the standard weekly deductions, if y'all want to know, if you want to know what those are with everything, we've got that on our website. I mean, check it out. Um, and, of course, you can call us. We can send it to you if you're not working here and you want to know what those weekly deductions are. We sure give them to you. Um, truck wash, you get truck wash here at Reserve Louisiana. Come out of your settlement. They spent $325 on truck washes here at Oakley, and then wash reimbursement, it would be, you know, they probably got to try to wash and we paid them back for it. So total expenses, $123,685 of expenses coming out of $470,000 gross. So that means they netted $346,000 in one year as a team pulling a pneumatic tank for Oakley Trucking. What a fantastic uh, paycheck that is or pay year that is and the the mileage here look down a little bit lower here on the mileage just so you can get an idea how many miles they ran loading miles were 114,000 empty miles 92,000 so they ran 206,000 miles in 2021 to earn a net of 346,721 dollars those are all the expenses taken out of there the only thing that's not um is the truck payment and their truck repairs if they had any. So that's the, that's the you take that out of that other net and that's what they uh, you know if you wanted to take in everything. So that is pneumatic tank. I want to uh, give you a couple of more uh, because I want to go over I'm not going to go line by line on the rest of them, but I'm going to give you some uh, End dumps and hoppers. Maybe another pneumatic guy here real quick, too. Uh, but first, let's hear from uh, our sponsor, Lube Zone. Cold weather and batteries don't go together. That's why Lube Zone is rolling out battery services this month at their locations. Get a battery test for free, a $30 value, and get a full system electrical test for $49.99, a $70 value. Lube Zone currently has 11 locations throughout Texas, Oklahoma, Georgia, and California with more on the way. They can do annual DOT inspections along with CSA inspections without making an appointment. Lube Zone thrives on giving great customer service to the truck driver, offering full service disclosure and advice without the intent to upsell additional products to you that you don't need. But don't forget what Lube Zone is famous for. Fast is back. 
Their goal is to provide good PM services as quick and efficient as possible so you can get back on the road. They offer three major oil brands, Shell, Dello, and Mobile products, along with OEM-approved filters. Stop by one of their locations and let us know how your experience was. Check out LubeZone.com for all their locations and tell them you heard about it on the Oakley Podcast. Okay, real quick, uh, let's do a, a pneumatic, another pneumatic, and uh, I'll put this up on the screen so you know you can see what he grossed and what his uh, expenses were. But this one was $282,305. This was a single owner-operator pulling for Oakley. He grossed 282000 and he netted – 214000 out of that. That's 76% he netted of his gross. That is fantastic. And his mileage, he did 105,773 miles to do that. That's how, you, uh, that's how you make money right there. That's a pneumatic. I had one more other pneumatic I was going to show you, and we'll put it up here on the screen so you can see it. This is a single owner-operator with pneumatic tanks. He did $308,577 was his gross. His expenses were ninety five thousand and he netted two thirteen. He netted two hundred and thirteen thousand out of three oh eight. That's seventy one percent and he ran a hundred and thirty one thousand miles. Pneumatics are they're a top pay at Oakley. That's that's the division we pay the most at. So let's take a couple uh end dumps and let me show you what they make. I think it just helps if you, you kind of see what each division makes because, you know, it's not too terribly far apart. You'd be surprised. So here's a single owner-operator on the end dump. We'll put his up here so you can you can see it. And he grows $269,000. 269308 to be exact. His expenses for the year were $75,000. So he netted – a hundred and ninety four thousand and twenty eight dollars out of two sixty nine that's seventy two percent and he ran a hundred and twenty nine thousand miles to do that that's on an end dump a solo owner operator here's one that's probably real close to the top if not the top end dump guy I haven't got a list of who's the you know very top yet I just kind of picked these out. This one here is $278,000 gross. Expenses were $78,000, so he netted $200,071. And he ran 130,000 miles. So that's, that's getting it. I mean, 130,000 miles, that's 2,500 miles a week average for 50 weeks. Let me give you a little bit of hopper info here while I'm on it. This one is, yeah, these are all single owner operators. So this single owner operator on the hopper division, he did $237,000 gross. His expenses were $79,000, and he netted $157,000 and ran 126,000 miles. So a little bit different from your dump guys because, they, you know, the dumps pay more. 20, I believe it was 20 cents a loaded mile more. Here's a hopper guy. He was amongst – I know this guy was among the top. Uh, $242,000 pulling a hopper. And expenses were 71000 and he netted $171,000. That's 70% of his gross pay that we paid him here at Oakley Trucking. And one more for the hopper, this guy – he did two hundred twenty-four thousand dollars. He grossed. His expenses were seventy-five thousand. He netted a hundred and forty-eight thousand dollars on one hundred twenty thousand miles. Gives you a little bit of information um, to look at and understand how simple the pay is at Oakley Trucking. I, I really appreciate the accounting department getting those ready for us and for everybody and all our own operators. You have those that you're fingertips that you can log into your driver portal and see your settlement summary for sure and i think it's great information it also helps us in recruiting we can give it to you just or you can look at it be transparent on what you can make here at oakley trucking and it's all up to you so once again hey, i appreciate everybody listening to the oakley podcast be sure and uh, and like and subscribe um, leave a comment 
that helps us a lot. And uh, if you got any questions or comments, you know, hey, if you need to call me up and tell me, that's fine. But uh, I need some information back from you guys. I really appreciate everybody listening. This has uh, been a good podcast for us, and we're going to keep it going. And if you have any questions about settlement summaries, man, call your dispatcher, call me. We'll go over it and understand it the best we can. We appreciate everybody listening to the Oakley Podcast. We'll talk to you next week. <laughs>